We still don't know what's causing birds to get sick and die in the mid-Atlantic and central states. Yeah, there have been no reports of any illnesses in Massachusetts, but state wildlife officials are asking people to take precautions this weekend. Boston 25 News reporter Jason Law followed one bird lover as he closed up shop in his backyard. It's sad for bird lovers out there to read about and see pictures of all those mysterious deaths to our south and west. This weekend, Mass Wildlife officials are asking everybody out there to take down all their bird feeders, at least until researchers can figure out what's making all the birds sick. It's a population not only for the birds, but the squirrels love coming out here. For years, Jack Bernazzani has filled his backyard with bird baths and feeders. Oh, it's great. We have some neighbors across the street that have young kids, and I love coming over here to see the birds at the feeders. Uh, really makes them excited. But Friday, we followed Bernazzani as he took down the food. Just trying to get them all down. And dumped out the pools of water. It's interesting to know what it is that's causing this. Mass wildlife officials issued an advisory this week after birds began dropping dead in 10 states from Indiana to Pennsylvania, down to Maryland and Virginia. The farthest case north was reported in New Jersey, but Massachusetts regulators are asking residents here to take precautions. We're trying to eliminate where birds congregate. Joan Walsh is with the Mass Audubon Society. In the summer, there's plenty of natural food, so she says you're not depriving birds of anything by taking down your seed. But it could be a while before researchers understand what is causing this avian outbreak. They don't know yet. Is it viral? Is it fungal? They don't know. But the first thing that you do is try and eliminate congregations. So that will buy us time if it is on its way. If you find a dead bird in your yard, Walsh says to use a plastic bag over your hand just like this to pick it up and then dispose of it. Walsh says if you find more than one dead bird in your yard, give Mass Wildlife a call. In Foxborough, Jason Law, Boston 25 News.